was just a couple months ago that Mr. Mellon was able to acquire, you know, the Granite Ridge site. So yeah. uh, we're, we're moving. The flag has officially been raised and they're open for business at the Mellon Heritage Veterans Outreach and Wellness Center. One of the center's goals is to help as many veterans as possible. The uh, freedom that we get was paid for by them. I've, I've lost too many friends already. An issue they're going to try and fix is reducing the number of veteran suicide. 22 veterans uh, in, a, in the U.S. a day died suicide, you know, because there's, we're still trying to get the, you know, get veterans to know that uh, your brothers are there for you. It's a brotherhood. So beginning on Monday, April 1st, the center is going to start offering veteran services to all who would like the assistance. From 10 to 2 on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, we're going to open the building and, you know, as we showed you we've got tables set up, we've got couches, some TVs, and we're actually asking folks if they've got comfortable furniture that they're not using, we'd love to have it. State Representative Jake Banta also explained that he'll be stopping by periodically. And being a veteran himself, he hopes the center will be able to bring our veterans closer together. If you serve, you know, you know the feeling you're halfway across the world and you got your, you're on a base with a bunch of people far away from home, far from family. You have a prayer, you have your food, uh, you, you, you disfellowship, you get along. And Mr. Richard Mellon said this center is a place for fellowship, networking, and hospitality. It shall serve as the first of many outreach services we hope to offer through the Mellon Heritage Foundation. In Northeast, Philip Ward, Erie News Now.